Hello everyone, this is my last update I do believe on the hardware uh, before I hand it off to my son to do the programming. Uh, what I'm showing here, well it won't focus on that I guess, uh, that close. Um, there is a LED and a photoresistor I put in the top of the box and that's for volume control. I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. The LED will light up. You won't be able to see it in action really because I got the box closed up but um, that's going to allow you to raise and lower your hand above this to control the volume the reflection of the light off your hand uh, causes the photoresistor and resistor uh, uh, network to vary the voltage to one of the analog inputs to the um, Arduino and the other thing I wanted to show is this LED that I placed on the side right here the screen one right here it's kind of really a, a diagnostic tool it's not really useful otherwise but if you go ahead and put your hand in front of or block the um, laser any one of these it will turn the LED on so you can kind of see at a glance. It's helped me, obviously, if it's uh, running a program, it'll uh, you'll get a tone out. But uh, for me, at least, to see if it's working, it's a good diagnostic tool. And that's tied directly to the interrupt that's going into the Arduino. As it turns out, I don't know it's, if it was all that necessary to uh, actually put the chips in in the circuit um, because I think it could have been programmed without that but it is as it is right now and I'm gonna turn it over to my son and let him do some programming and next video hopefully we're gonna have some sound out of it so thanks for watching